Hello YouTube, today I'm doing a review of Screwfix's backpack sprayer. Uh, it's a basic sprayer um, that you put on your back, um, $16.99 and um, we're going to give it a go and um, see how it's going to do today on uh, the lawn I've just scarified. So if you look to my right you'll see that I have blasted the hell out of an area of our lawn, been around with a scarifier, um, three different passes so it's pretty bold in places. I'm going to put some iron on it today and um, some other lawn fertiliser treatments um, using this sprayer. So it was pretty easy to put together really, didn't take me more than about five minutes really. Um, you've got this lever pump mechanism on the side here so I'll just show that in more detail when I do a, a demo in a bit later and this is a 12 litre capacity I'm not sure whether I'll bother filling all that up today but I'm going to make up some mixture of iron um, that's dissolved in water and uh, maybe put a bit of fertiliser in there as well dump it in the top there and just open this up now just to show you what it's like yeah, you've got sort of a, a filter type mechanism in there as well. A nice big opening. Seems pretty well built. There's no brand name or anything like that on there. Um, it just is what it is. Probably something made in China, no doubt. And it comes with a nice clip there so you can stick the hose on there when you're not using it trigger mechanism itself that's also got a clip on it for storage it just folds out like so I suppose you can also clip it up when you're using it so it's on the constant spray mode so pretty straightforward it's a case of fill it up and um, carry on carry on going up and down see what it does really okie doke right so far um, I'm just mixing up this iron. So what I've got is I've got five five litres of water in the bucket there, and I've got this um, uh, solid iron. Um, so you can see what type it is there, pro clean stuff. And I'm just going to uh, put this into a pestle and mortar at the minute. Actually, um, just give it a bit of a grind down, make sure there's no lumps in it. I'm doing this one handed so bear with me. It probably won't need that much of a grind down actually, just enough to get the main main lumps out. Don't want anything to clog the actual um, uh, mechanism on the nozzle. Break down the particles a bit. Yeah, I'm going slightly cloudy, but it's not too bad. So, what I'll put in here now is five scoops full, and um, that should be enough to cover roughly 150 square meters. I don't want to give it too much of a blast out, I'm literally just doing this iron treatment to clear up any remaining um, moss that hasn't been picked up by the scarifier, kill that off, maybe give the, um, the new growing grass a bit of an extra start. That's about it, so I'm just prepping the ground and I'll seed straight afterwards. Now it's worth mentioning this water is actually mildly warm, lukewarm as well. Helps it dissolve a bit better. Right, you can actually still see small particles floating about in that now. 
Um, but anyway, the next part of this, I'm going to include a small amount of um, this stuff. So this is a lawn tonic um, with some seaweed extract in it. Um, it's got all your general MPK type stuff in it. Um, nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium. Um, you've got some magnesium in there as well. Um, and seaweed extract, that makes up like 1%. Um, so they reckon you can put in 100 mils of this per four and a half litres. Um, I've done five litres of water here, but I'm still going to stick with that, um, that, that 100 mils. So yeah, dump that in, give it a mix up. Although I can still see very small particles in this, um, it did say in the instructions that backpack spray that as long as you um, agitate the, the container as you're um, going around spraying even stuff with, um, even mixtures with small particles or lumps in can pass through it. So it's a case of just keeping the mixture moving I think, unless I can see that it breaks down and dissolves any more than it already is. As long as there's no major lumps I'm happy in, and I don't think there is. Right, it's about an hour since I spread that um, uh, <coughs> iron down and um, looking at this, there's already some evidence of the moss going black or a dark brown colour so it's certainly starting to take effect um, so that will either die off completely or if it doesn't, I think it's probably taken enough of a battering just to be outcompeted by the grass when I reseed it so that's what I'm about to do now put some seed down and um, hopefully repopulate all of this lot and uh, yeah in the next few weeks hopefully we should have some uh, grass seedlings come up and it will um, fill out and look really nice that's for the gadget here, the backpack sprayer 
yeah it's worked pretty much as I expected you do have an adjustable nozzle where you can screw it up and down to give you a finer or a wider spray I didn't bother with it I just um, started off as it was and that seemed to be good enough really you hold it quite close to the ground so you're getting a more direct hit on whatever you're aiming at and um, I just went up and down in um, lengths of probably about a meter wide as you probably just saw and you just I just used a couple of forks to mark out the area really garden forks and just swap them over every time you do a lap to get an even spread really so yeah um, Quite impressed with this, 1699, can't really complain. Seems pretty good quality build. So yeah, let me know what you think in the comments section. Um, give us a thumbs up or a like. Uh, thank you for watching.